In this video, I'm going to be sharing three exercises that Ronnie Coleman used to develop his massive biceps so that you can use them too. Make sure to watch exercise number three because it is by far my favorite bicep exercise and is guaranteed to give you an insane pump. Also, make sure to stick around to the end of the video where I will share some extra information about bicep exercises to help you get bigger faster. The first of the three exercises is the bicep isolation curl. For this exercise, all you will need is a dumbbell and a bench. You want the bench at an incline and you want to rest your arm against it like Ronnie Coleman is doing in this video. Then you just curl the weight. The bicep isolation curl is a great way to isolate the bicep and not allow your arm to sway, which makes curling easier, like it can in other bicep exercises. The bicep isolation curl really helps build the height of the bicep and should be added to your bicep routine. The second exercise is the seated hammer curl. For this exercise, you will need a pair of dumbbells and a bench. To perform this exercise, you sit on the bench and perform hammer curls like Ronnie Coleman is doing here. They are called hammer curls because the way you hold the dumbbells looks like a hammer. You want to keep your elbows tucked in at your sides and your upper body straight. You don't want to be moving and swinging because that takes the tension off the biceps. This is a great exercise to build both the biceps and the forearms. The third exercise, which is my personal favorite, has a few different names, but I call them 21s. For this exercise, you will only need a barbell. The point of this exercise is you break down each part of a bicep barbell curl into three parts. The first part is the lower portion of the curl and you only move your arm from the bottom position until your arms hit 90 degrees at the elbow, as you can see Ronnie Coleman doing here. You do this movement seven times, then bring the barbell all the way to the top of the curl movement and lower the barbell down to 90 degrees at the elbow, as you can see Ronnie Coleman doing here. This works the upper portion of the curl and you do this seven times. Lastly, you do seven full curls from bottom to top, which you can see Ronnie Coleman doing here. You do these all back to back with no rest and they are called 21s because you do seven curls of the bottom portion, seven curls of the top portion, and seven full curls, which equals 21. I promise you, your arms will burn after this exercise and I typically like to do this exercise as a finisher or last exercise of the workout. Now, time for the extra information to get your biceps bigger faster. The best way to get your biceps bigger faster is to limit shoulder movement in all of your bicep exercises. The front delt, aka your shoulder, wants to help your bicep perform the curls. You have to limit shoulder movement and elbow movement to completely target the bicep and not give it the help it wants. By making this change to all of your bicep exercises, your bicep will get bigger faster. All three of these exercises, the bicep isolation curl, seated hammer curl, and 21s are all great exercises that you can use to increase the size and strength of your biceps. You should do 8 to 10 reps for each arm in 3 to 4 sets for the bicep isolation curls and seated hammer curls, but stick to the 7 reps for 21s and do 3 to 4 sets of 21s. Always use a weight you can manage and don't compromise form to lift a heavier weight. This is the best way to grow your biceps and prevent injuries. I want to thank you for watching this video, and if you have any other muscle groups you want me to cover or other exercise you think I should have mentioned, please leave a comment below. Thank you for watching.